Hello and welcome to Is It Accessible? Today we're checking out a game that is in early access right now, which is FNAF Special Delivery. This is the newest entry into the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise, and it's a cell phone app. Keep in mind that this is, again, in early access, and new features are going to be added every day. Make sure to subscribe and hit like so we can keep you updated as things change. First off, if you have a sensitivity to flashing lights, this game has a lot of them, and this video will be showing some of the gameplay. There aren't a lot of options as far as accessibility goes, other than being able to turn the vibration on and off, so if you have color blindness to the current palette, you're SOL. There are no options for subtitles. There will be occasional speech bubbles on the main map as the animatronics move around, but beyond that there are no subtitle indicators. The upside is that the emails that come across are a decent size for a cell phone app. I would like to be able to zoom in or choose a larger font in the future. The buttons on the bottom are a good size and they're responsive. If you click on one of the incoming animatronics, you have the option to pull them in faster, but they do move around the map. Now once an animatronic has come knocking on your door, you click the middle icon and you get to try and search your room for it. They are cloaked, so you need to search for static to know where they're coming from. It can be hard to see the static because I have mostly white or beige walls and I struggle to see in low light, so I have to crank up the brightness on my phone, turn on all the lights in my house, and switch the flashlight on in game to catch the static. The flashlight does require battery power in game, so you have to use it sparingly. The sounds of the animatronics do not have subtitles, so if you're hard of hearing, you may miss out on some of the audio cues. For the most part, the audio cues let you know which animatronic is in the room with you, when they're moving, how fast they're moving, and provide some hints for how much time you have left. It's definitely playable without sound, but it is significantly harder to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Baby, Foxy, Balloon Boy, and Springtrap without the audio cues. The upside is if you aren't able to hear the audio cues, or if you aren't able to see very well, the vibration function is immensely helpful. When the animatronics take steps, your phone will vibrate. Depending on who you're up against, you may run into a glitch where it's nearly impossible to see. You'll need to shake your phone to clear the glitch. I've only seen it happen a few times with the rare animatronics. Once you find the static, you'll eventually get charged and you'll need to shock the animatronic as it comes out of stealth. If you don't, you get jump scared. You can also look for remnants. You look around your room for small lights to spawn that are drawn to your flashlight. There are also dark remnants that you'll want to avoid unless you want to call Shadow Bonnie. If you're hard of hearing, your phone will vibrate when the remnants spawn and the frequency of the vibration increases the closer you get to them. As you draw on the dark remnants, the screen will also get darker and harder to see. If you're not mobile, you're still good to go on this game. As long as you can look around the room with your phone, you're set. I've tried playing facing forward and not turning my torso at all. Remnants will eventually spawn in front of me and I can exit to the map or just sit and wait until the dark edges clear out if I pick up too many dark ones. It may be coincidence, but if I'm facing forward during an animatronic encounter and it's not directly in front of me, exiting to the main map and going back in seems to reset the animatronic location, so I go back and forth until it's going to run right in front of me. Once you pick up remnants, you can use it on one of your endoskeletons, which can be sent out for parts or to attack a friend. That's all we have for now for FNAF Special Delivery. If you want to give it a try, I've got a link in the description below for an invite to play and be friends with yours truly. We'll let you know as more features get updated, so make sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching.